Imagine looking at your charge, you blowing. We just talk about how far we're going. Now you're the one that I'm hardly knowing. It's been like two years and we hardly spoken. Fact. Should have been there in my darkest moment. So much fucking phone calls in my life. You guys are scared, innit? You think I'm. Well, I mean, God, you, a lot of men, even in the camp, don't know what's going on. Do you understand what I'm saying? So. Everyone that thought Dutch was fucking that 14 year old girl and troubling a 14 year old girl, shame on you. Egg on your faces, innit? It was never the 14 year old girl. It was the 14 year old girl's mum, Anne. You get me? Yeah? That is who Dutch was linking and doing and doing and they were doing their thing together, innit? Yeah? But for some strange reason, they're keeping it a secret. But most of the people in Fox's family know this anyway. That's why a lot of people didn't speak out about this paedophile thing because they know it's not the daughter. They know it's Anne. Do you get it? And they thought. By pushing that thing out, I think they thought that, oh, Anne will confess to fucking Dutch. But she just didn't. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, I was with Dutch when Dutch went and bought Anne Chanel trainers. And when he went and told me to go, go with him to bring her son to go and get him Balenciagas and some new garms and that. Because Dutch fucks with the woman, innit? That's it. You don't buy, you don't buy the daughter nothing. And you know what? You guys are idiots as well. Because you guys all seen the mum. You've all seen her profile. You've all seen shit. Yeah? And none of you fucking clocked. None of you clocked on the Instagram where it says about the sunbathing that she's tanning. Hold on, let me put it up for you guys. Because you know I don't lie. I just tell the truth what it is. I don't, I don't give a fuck if Dutch is mad. I don't care, innit? How about that, innit? You know, like that. But I'm not going to be listening to man's a paedophile when I know man's not a paedophile. Man's chopping down big women. Like, what's all this about, bro? And the people, I feel, that are not saying nothing when they should be saying something and speaking out for him properly are taking a piss. And most of those messages in that Instagram are from the mum, Yeah. But you guys are not really taking it in. But watch, I'm going to make you take it in now. Didn't just tell you guys the truth is because you guys are coming out of all your conspiracy theories about Fox. So he couldn't tell you, yeah, I'm linking Fox's brother's widow. That looks all mad, didn't it? Because then you guys are going to make up some bigger conspiracy theories, innit? But... Since Dutch ain't going to just talk on it, I'm going to talk on it because I see it with my own eyes, innit? Remember, I know everything that's going on. I know who's doing what, when what's doing what, you get me? Well, you think man's just going out there, going selfishes and making me drive all the way to fucking West London to go buy um, and a pair of fucking Chanel trainers for... Do you get what I'm saying, bro? And the clues are in the statement as well. You guys are so stupid, you don't want to see it because you want to believe that I'm, like someone that's doing good and is successful is a paedophile. Come on, bro. Let's be serious. That's what I was trying to explain to you guys Low key, like, come on, Gary Glitter can't get away with it. Fucking Rolf Harris can't get away with it. But a black guy from the ghetto can get away with it without being arrested, charged, nicked, questioned, court case, nothing. No, get the fuck out of there, man. Come on, bro. About grooming, like, you guys are dangerous. What you guys are saying, though. Think about it. Anne's a good person. She is a good woman, innit, Pete, Dan? Well, from what I see of her, I see she's a good woman, innit, yeah? So I don't want no one going after her and her family because that's just nonsense, innit, yeah? But it's not what you thought it was. Do you get it, yeah? Anne is in her 50s. Dutch is 27, yeah? You can laugh at that and say what the fuck you want to say about that, but it ain't no 14-year-old child. And if it was a 14-year-old child, I'd disown Dutch first. Are you got nuts about that, bro? I just come out of jail, but fuck all that, bro. Man, man. Nah, bro. Like, do you, what, you think like, Dutch has been around me since you Oh, you think I don't know? I know Dutch better than he knows his fucking self. How about that? You get me? So when Dutch thought, oh, he's linking Anne on the sly around me, you think I didn't know? Bro, I know you ain't out there buying no fucking £950 trainers for nobody. <laughs> and then buying her son. Because that's what I, I, that's the sort of shit I would do. I'm not going to lie. If I'm trying to finesse a team, and like, do you get what I'm saying? I'm probably going to just pull out this, a few more stops, innit? Like, come on, bro. Like, Dutch knows I know. Like, everybody knows I know around the family. Uh, how about the family told me the day I was going to jail, they told me, Dutch is fucking earned. They know. They've all known. But they all, they was all hoping. They pushed that out on Dutch. And then Dutch will say, oh, no, I've been seeing Anne, not the 14 year old. And then they can bash him about that. You get me? And say, oh, you're not loyal to our family or snake and all this shit. I saw what the game was, innit? But game over, innit? I'm out. I told you guys. When I come out, I'm exposing every fucking thing, innit? Yeah? You guys were talking shit and everyone's trying to cover up shit. And mum's not on it, bro. Let's just tell the truth. Get it in the open and we can all move past it, innit? Like, yes, Dutch weren't banging no 14 year old or trying to chop no 14 year old. He was chopping the mum, innit? The big woman. But at the same time, that's their business, innit? They're big people. They can do what they want to do. You know what I'm saying? That's the real facts of it.
I don't give a shit about all of this and who's pissed off and who wants to say I don't give a shit. I just told the truth what I saw, I see. I don't hold Dutch no loyalty neither no more. So I don't have to keep you secret for him. But of this situation, not to mug anyone or mug the situation, but Anne's son is older than Dutch in it. So work it out like that as well, innit? So there's, there's bare little angles why this thing is not cool and it's not calm. But I'm sorry, like, it's a joke thing. Bear man of big women and older women, yeah? No one can't tell me I'm lying because you guys have seen must my insta for how many years you've seen dutchies i'm with dutch all day every day i link dutch at 10 in the morning i leave, I leave dutch at three in the, i leave dutch 10 in the morning and i leave the following day at three in the morning after studio and all our running arounds and errands and all the bullshit we do music wise like i'm with the guy the whole day when i go when he goes to link Ann, i go to Anne's as well yeah so i'm around the daughters when i see them when dutch is rubbing their heads like little kids yeah and when he's cuddling up the mum come on bro i know do you get me there's no secrets, bro. I'm, I, I'm, I just want the truth out there because it's just pissing me off. Like, and I'm sitting there and man's not telling man the truth. I'm thinking, bro, the truth. I'm sorry I exposed it the way I exposed it, but I'm I fucking had enough of it, bro. Everyone's like, oh, what's your opinion? And, da -da 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 -da. and I'm getting voice notes that Dutch is a paedophile. And, but I'm chewing your pants, man, and chill out, bro. Man, Dutch ain't no paedophile, bro. Like, the whole thing's there. You guys just chose to miss it because you wanted to leave scandal. Because you see, in the country we live, Every per everybody that makes it out of the ghetto, instead of us being proud of them, of their achievements, we want to sit there and slander them and put them down and find some dirt on them. Or, do you know what I'm saying? It's weird, bro. Just let people be successful, innit? Like, that's it, innit, about paedophile. You get me? The only reason, as I said, the only reason why Anne is using her daughter's phone and not her own phone is because her older son has always got her phone. Do you get what I'm saying? So therefore, if, say if Dutch messages Anne on her phone, the, the son's going to see it and the game's up, innit? It is what it is, innit? But the paedophile thing, yeah, drop that out now, it's dead, innit? Like, you guys know the truth, innit? Go read over her statement again. And she put bare clues in there. But big up all the people that had brains and the common sense and knew it was all bullshit anyway, innit? Like, I hope I just cleared this up for you guys, because, like, as I said, I ain't got no reason to defend Dutch, and neither would I. I would never defend any guy who's a, who I know to be a paedophile or a rapist. I've had man that tried to hang around me back in the day when I was a youth man, got nicked for a rape, I gave man the benefit of the doubt, Man got nicked for another rape. I had to drop him out. I said, nah, bruv. Like, you got nicked for two rapes, bruv. I can't be around you, mate. You get me? You got to fuck off. You're, you're a rapist, bruv. You know what I'm saying? Because you got to look at it. Some man never get a rape case in their life. So that's how I got to look at it. If I, I don't care what it is. It's only true I know because I see in my own eyes what's going on in front of me. These guys think I'm stupid or some shit. I don't know. I'm an OG, you know? Come on, man. Man could do these granddad emojis. And so when you guys think, oh... Monster just didn't give up on Dutch because his brethren's fuck the brethren's thing. I'm not on all that. I'm, we're not even brethren's right now. We ain't been brethren's. Like, all you niggas noticed I ain't been in a couple music videos and that because I left the thing because I just wasn't on it. You know, you know what I'm saying? So, I've got no reason to lie or speak up for no one. But in this instance, I have to speak up because it's, it's taking a piss what I'm seeing going on, innit? Like, man's been trolled with lies. It's not even funny, bro. And for the trolls who troll shit without the full information, stop doing that, bro. It's embarrassing, bro. Like, cause now, look. Now it's being cleared up. And then now it actually makes fucking sense, bro. Now everyone's going to be looking at it, scratching their heads now. How do you, how do you go back to telling a man sorry from that? Like, remember, all these celebrities don't owe you nothing. All, anyone that's, that's in, on, in, on the stage or got a fucking fa following or fans, they don't need to tell you nothing. They don't owe you nothing, can it? And just because man ain't telling you nothing, it don't make man guilty of nothing. It just means it's none of your fucking business, innit? It's called nanya, nanya business. Listen, I'm just going to end it on this, isn't it, yeah? I'm not taking nothing down, so please don't waste your time phoning me because I'm airing everyone until the 24 hours is up and everyone can see my shit, innit? And then everyone can see the truth, what's really going on. Because I'm sick and tired of this shit. I'm sick and tired of explaining it to people but can't really explain it to people the way I want to explain it to people because it's Dutch's business, innit? But since people keep on asking me to speak on it and since Dutch won't speak on it and Anne won't speak on it, I'm going to speak on it, innit? I don't give a shit. It's not that deep, bro. It's not that serious. And I'll, I'll be even more, I'll be even 100, even more 100, like certain family members on Fox's side got dropped out. So I expected this. It's called a power move. Do you get it? It's called leverage. It's a power move. They done, saw the messages with Anne, deleted all the messages they saw with Anne and Dutch and tried to make out like, oh, because it's on the daughter's thing. Less people are going to do this power move thing and try to, some family members are going to try to push out the lie. But a lot of you stayed quiet. And the reason a lot of you stayed quiet on Fox's side, yeah, is because you knew what was going on between Dutch and Anne. Not the daughter, not Angel, Dutch and Anne, the mum. You knew what was going on. But you guys thought, oh, 
because you got dropped out, you do something spiteful and then try to make Dutch look like an idiot. So then Anne has to explain it and then you can embarrass her. And then, obviously they're so dopey. They didn't expect it to, to catch fire like it caught fire. But the real truth is it caught fire and now I'm putting it out because it's a madness what you guys have done. And it's a madness how you guys have let it turn into this. Like, you get what I'm saying? The fuck is going on? Like, I see it with my own eyes, bro. You can't lie to me, bro. You can lie to the person that wasn't there. You can't lie to the person that was there. I've seen it. When I'm coming to Anne's yard, Dutch, you tell me why we're going to Anne's yard. Would you think me and Dutch don't talk? Come on, man. But anyway, sorry, Dutch. Sorry, Anne, but... <laughs>